a good dinner of Shabbos, welcome to a taste of Shabbos, and welcome all of Torah Anytime viewers, and thank you Torah Anytime for sharing Torah around the globe, especially at this time. At the end of our double Parsha, right before we sing Chazak in Parshas Bechukosai, is the mitzvah, the final mitzvah in Vayikra of Meiser Behema. And the Torah states, V'chol Meiser Bakr Vatzon, and any Meiser, any tenth animal of cattle and sheep, Kol Asher Yavor Tachas Hashav, Shavat, any one that passes under the uh, stick, Asiri Iye Kodesh Lashem. That tenth animal, so we're taught, Rashi says, he takes a stick and he puts a little red on it, and you know that that's your Miser animal. And that Miser animal, Miser Behema, either has to be brought up to Yerushalayim to consume there, or its proceeds, if you uh, flip the proceeds of the worth of the animal, are able to take, I believe, the worth of the animal or, or an additional animal if you're, you know, make a tamura. But it has to be that that was brought up to Yerushalayim. We have 613 mitzvahs. What are they coming to teach us? What's behind this mitzvah? Okay, miser, every tenth, you know. We learn also with our income. We learn with our uh, grain. What is this miser behema business? Like, leave my animals alone. A conis tzon ladir. My flock. The Sefer HaChinuch writes Mishorash HaMitzvah so beautifully. And before I read it to you, I want to say the following. Can you imagine if a parent has been away from his children for a long time? The child went overseas, the child was in the military, the child was far away in yeshiva, the child distanced himself for whatever reason. And the parent says, would you come? I want you to come. I have something for you. And the child's always so busy, and the child always has what to do, and, and, and it, it always gets put off until the time that the child comes and sees what the parent had waiting for him. It's so beautiful. It's so inspiring. It fuels the child and reconnects the love that the parent and the child have for one another until the next time that they'll have this gathering again. Says the Sefer Achinuch, Hakel Baruchu, Bachar Bam Yisrael. Hashem, our Father, chose us, the Jewish people. V'chaf Hitzlaman Sitko Lios Kula Moske Toros of Yodeshmo. And God wants us to involve ourselves in His Torah and to know His name. Ubechachmaso Mashcham Bamitzvah Zulaman Yilmadu Yikhu Musr. The whole purpose of this mitzvah is to get us to come to the Beis HaMikdash. Ki yodei ha'elokim, shero b'nei adam nimshach ha'machar ha'chomer ha'pachos v'shagam basar. Since human beings are just flesh and blood, we follow the things that uh, attract us. V'lo yitnu nafsham ba'amal ha'torah ba'askatam edem. It's so easy to get distracted and pulled away even with the free time that we have. al kein sivev betvunaso, therefore this is one of those mitzvahs. V'nasan lehem mokom sheyedu akol divrei toroso akoponim. He built into our actions that we should know and experience and be inspired by Torah. She'ein safek he kol adam nimchach likboa diroso v'mokom shemamonosho. Every year a Jew had to bring up 
their miser behema, or the worth, for who Yerushalayim, to God's house, to the parents' house. Shashama Sanhedrin Yode Das Mavine Mada. And that's where they would get their spiritual infusion. And the same thing is true when we bring Meiser Shani, right? etc. So often, a Jew has an obligation for mitzvahs. Could they be doing mitzvahs all day long? We do them and we don't even know that we're doing them. We should have in mind that we're doing them. I like to tell the story about the time we were in Eretz Yisrael and a handyman came to fix our dryer, a washing machine. And he was there all day and he was such a fantastic worker. And when he was done and he said to my wife, the Rebetzin, uh, it's such and such money, she wrote up the check and she was about to hand it to him. And he said, wait, have in mind you're fulfilling the mitzvah of paying your worker on time. We don't even realize the mitzvahs that we're doing. And realize that every mitzvah is a gift. A mitzvah is a commandment, but a mitzvah is also a connection. And this last mitzvah of par in the book of Vayikra shows us that with every mitzvah that we do, there's the opportunity for great connection with HaKadosh Baruch Hu. Wishing everybody a wonderful Shabbos.